Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Let's crack into another one. Oh, the soft and sultry tones of the Crazy Town Podcast. Oh. TNT, I have uh, a story for you. Okay, Jonas. I'm in, by the way, Jonas, I'm enjoying a nice glass of uh, chamomile tea, coffee. I, I don't know what I'm drinking. It's dark roast coffee. Dark roast. Ooh, Duncan. From the hills yeah. of... Duncan. Oh. <laughs> yeah, have you Richard. ever down the hills of Duncan in a sled, ladies? Um, anyways, so, mm. Austin, Texas. We, we, we live there. Yeah, there, uh, the other day, there, there was a fire on the freeway, near the freeway, middle uh, of the night. Really? Yeah. I missed it. Yeah, yeah, we were all in sleeping because it was at like 3 o'clock in the morning. I mean, I was awake probably. <laughs> yeah, probably. So... The firemen are out there doing something with this weird fire on the freeway, right? <laughs> Is it a weird fire? How many times have you seen a fire on the freeway? I mean, never. Yeah, exactly. Weird fire. No, never mind. You know what? There was the one time I saw a tanker overturned and on flames. Yeah, I mean, like... I think we've all maybe seen a car on fire or smoldering or something. Yeah, you know? That was super cool, by the way. <clears throat> so the like firemen are out working on the fire. <clears throat> a rando approaches <clears throat> the fireman. On the freeway, because uh-huh. you're, you know, pedestrians walk on the freeway all the time. In Austin, yes. Yeah. Stabs the fireman. Just walks up, stabs the fireman. Yep. With a knife. Yep. Four o'clock in the morning. Okay. Uh, I mean, the fireman, he went to the hospital. He, did, he wasn't seriously injured or anything, thank God. Yeah. Guy went to jail, obviously, for assault with a deadly weapon, probably. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But, like... You're a fireman. You're doing a fire at 4 a.m. on the freeway. The last thing you think is someone's going to run up and stab you. Yeah, I mean, look, if you lived in any other state outside of uh, California, Texas, or Florida, and I'm tentatively Atlanta or uh, Georgia, um, I would say is that, yes, that would be a weird occurrence. But because we live in one of those states, I'm honestly surprised you didn't get shot. I was gonna say I'd be more likely to think they'd just shoot him than stab him. Like, but but knives are way cheaper than guns. I just, I I feel like, okay, people. There's a strong community of people that dislike police officers. Yeah. Why? What do you got against firemen? They're out here just saving mother effers. They're putting out fires. They're getting cats out of trees. Mm -hmm. They're helping old ladies. Mm -hmm. They're doing all sorts of stuff. They're making calendars in their muscles. Maybe they don't like the mustaches, man. (laughs) Is that a prerequisite? (laughs) You must be buff and have a mustache and be a firefighter. There's a fireman mustache thing where it's like mustache and no beard because, like, obviously you don't want a beard because you can't fit the uh, the gas mask on. And that's why firemen have the mustache and not the beard. That's actually a reason because they can't fit the mask on, but you want some facial hair, right? Do you think we could go to the fire station and they would let us sit in the fire truck? Yes. Like at our age now. Like yes. we would be like, listen, will you let me sit in the fire truck? Will you yeah. t- let me tour the fu- Jonas, you grown already, ass men. No, you already look like a make a wish kid. We could <laughs> uh, we could <laughs> easily <laughs> just tell them. Holy shit. <laughs> a second. What? Wait, what? No, let me finish. Okay, all right. <laughs> Yeah, I'm go done. Ahead. I'm go ahead. Walk done. that walk down this path. Go ahead. All right. All right. So build we, that build make we, that bed. We go in there and we tell them that you have like, I don't know, gout. And then gout. <laughs> my poor buddy here's got gout. Got a terminal case of gout. And he always wanted to ride on the th- on the on the train. <laughs> They're like, excuse me, sir, this is a firehouse, not a train station. Well, I also have a brain tumor. <laughs> So wow. sometimes I F Say my words the wrong up. words. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So is there a train station where we could get in the conductor's seat? Because <laughs> that sounds fun, too. Oh, uh, wow. Not in Texas. In Ohio, they're, they're all over yeah, the place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, there's trains that run through Texas, but none of them are, like, stopping here. We should try that on a Saturday. What, I don't know where the closest firehouse is, but, like, just, like, wander up and just be like, knock, knock. Hey, hey guys. <laughs> Bring up some cookies, dude. Go to H E B, get like a fruit plate, and be like, "Listen, a fruit plate. We come fruit bearing. Plate. We come bearing gifts. Why would you bring a? It went from cookies to a fruit plate. Both cookies. Some and of them are fruit watching plate? their weight. They're in. Like, they're all cutting ish. They can't be all eating cookies. Okay. All they're right. out there washing the truck with their shirts off. And we're like, listen, gentlemen. Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't like where this is going. <laughs> <laughs> but continue. And we're just like, hey, we'll allow it to we're happen. We're just two normal guys. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> 
<laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Will you let me ride in the fire truck? Can we go for a ride? Yeah, we're can I ride in the can I ride in the can we get the Dalmatian? We're both out? We're Where's both, the Dalmatian? Because I want to see him. We're both old enough to be your dad. <laughs> can I slide down your pole? He's like, excuse me, boomer. <laughs> yeah, can we can we go up to the sleeping quarters? Can we oh, s- <laughs> hold on? So wait a minute. We approach these shirtless <laughs> wet firemen. And ask them if we can slide down their pole and take us to the sleeping quarters. You're the one that talks about pole sliding. You know damn well if they befriend us, we're sliding down that freaking pole. Don't don't bullshit me. You know the pole. The only second to the fire truck itself is the fire pole. Interesting story. Yes. I went to a gentleman's club in Minnesota. Okay. It was a two-story gentleman's club. And they had a flipping pole that went from the top floor to the bottom floor yeah. on the stage. And like Did it move? No, the women would like slide down the pole, like from the top floor to the second floor. Oh, okay. And it was like it blew my mind. Cause like I was just sitting there like hanging out with my buddies, and all of a sudden, like chicks are just coming through the floor. And I was like, what the and he was like, Oh yeah, there's two floors here. And I'm like, That's cool. Excuse me? That's Anyways, cool. back to the the no, fire. Everyone else keep on that stripper on the host thing. Did uh did you realize that the strippers, when they like go around the pole, this is not necessarily just for you. This is also for the listeners. But when the strippers are spinning around the pole like that, it's not them moving. The pole actually just spins. It's like it's got ball bearings in it and the pole spins. So really, they're just. Oh, they're, they're holding themselves straight. They're just holding one position and the pole is just spinning. It's not them actually spinning around. Well, the pole. that makes sense because they use the friction of their body to keep themselves stable. And they, yeah. I mean, it still takes work because they have to like yeah. stay still. And like, yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, that, that actually like, I've never thought about that, yeah. but that makes a lot of sense because it looks if, cool though. If right? they <laughs> didn't have the friction, they would just slide down, down the pole, down the pole. Yeah. Oh yeah. I guess that makes, so they kind of, it kind of ruins the magic a little bit, right? It's like, yeah. Cause I mean, they use momentum and then the, the pole like just spins yeah. on bearings. That, that makes yeah. a lot more sense. Cause now you look at it and you're like, well, wait a minute. Anybody could do what you're doing. Like, no, I ain't going to get up there and hold that pose. I mean, you could do like one or two poses. I'm, I think you could get up there. I'd support you. I'd bring I, some dollars. I'm, ah, man. If you want to put a pole in the living room and become a professional pole dancer. I mean, I'll I sit would, here and critique you. I'll take you. a Carmen Electra striptease exercise class there you go yeah, i think they have that on youtube or something hey, now. hey look i'm gonna tell you right now though if i'm your if i'm your stripper manager i'm gonna tr- i'm like a, i'm like a russian ball- ballerina uh teacher all right oh wow we are you're gonna work young lady all right <laughs> i gotta put the work in yes i'm gonna have like a riding crop and every time you f up i'm gonna tap the body part that no oh wow <laughs> stiffen that leg yeah it's carbon electra's advanced aerobic striptease all right. Will that make me a popular boy? Probably. Yeah. It, it's, we live in Austin, so yes, that will make you a popular boy. All I want to do is be a popular boy. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a, and it's the right month for you too, by the way. Happy happy Pride Month, Jonas. How do you oh, feel about that? I love it. Okay, good. Yeah. That's the I way that's see, the answer I did see you someone should Someone online talk I mean some it was I think it was it was somebody who was upset that um veterans only get like two days. And, yeah. like, they have a Pride Month. And I was like, oh, I mean, that's a valid point, I guess. But, like, I don't think we should take away the Pride Month to get we, – we'll figure out another month for veterans, right? Like, yeah, I think veterans deserve deserve more. Yeah, like, I was like, okay. Like, it was like – I feel like it was – I feel like it was founded in hate. But I tried to find, like, the silver lining in it. Like, yeah, it's, like, ki- it's kind of like – it's kind of, well, did they get this? Why don't we get this? Like, come on, man. Yeah, right. Exactly. Why you got to put somebody else's somebody else down in order to try to prop yourself up? Yeah, I mean, at least the two two days for veterans, everything closes. Yeah. So like they get like the world shuts down for them. Yeah, there's no there's no pride holiday. You don't get paid holiday for being gay. No. Even though I'm sure if the LGBTQ community could finagle that, they would. I mean, if I could get free paid days off for anything, I would take it. Yeah, like you get one for being white. Like uh, white appreciation day. You I, don't, I don't want that. You don't want a white appreciation no. day? No. I'm all about it, Joe. No, I feel dude. like white people need a, a, a day of appreciation. White, I don't like think a white so. Juneteenth. <laughs> the white Juneteenth. <laughs> it's, the, it's the 4th of July, dude. There's just a bunch of white folks came and stole this land. What would it That's... be called, Jonas? What would, what would the white holiday be called, uh, Joe? I want to know. Let's see I can't here. name it because I feel like it would be in bad faith. Uh, What, what, what would it be I called? wouldn't want to offend your culture by I naming I mean, I it. wouldn't mind, but... <laughs> um, 
Let's see here. Uh, what would it be called? Yeah, yeah, Ooh. yeah. I feel like you would have to do something to do with like Tom, taking things that don't belong to us. Tom Cruise Day. Oh God, no. Hey, Hank's what? Day. Hank. <laughs> Wait, so Tom Cruise Day. Oh, yeah, that's what I meant. Tom Hanks. Dang it, I meant Tom Hanks, not Tom Cruise. I know, I'm joking. Uh, really I don't Tom know Hanks what it would Day. be called, but it would be it would be in bad taste, probably, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah. So that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please <laughs> make sure to go. I was enjoying this one. Go to thecrazytown.com and uh, for Jonas. TNT. Oh, yeah. It's all right.